Hello, hello, hello. So we are in the new season's best. Still cooking. We are doing the quick cooker, Mediterranean chicken, and the rice bowl. Yum. Um, so I, again, this is not what I've done before. So bear with me. So I'm putting the sear on. So we're gonna sear our onion. Right now, I just had the two, um, hello, the two tablespoons of butter in. And now I'm gonna put the onion in. That one stuck. Hello, hello, hello. How's everyone doing this Saturday? My kids just got home, so of course, first thing I want to do is eat. So I'm cooking dinner. Oops, and I almost cut my finger. I always get nervous. I should just use the quick slice. I have it out. Oh, there it is. I hear the searing. It's starting to sear now. And we're going to cheat tonight. Um, this one calls for garlic, and lately I haven't really been tasting the garlic in our meals, so I'm going to use this cheat, and hopefully I can taste the garlic. It does call for Greek rub for this recipe, which I don't have the Greek rub, so I'm going to use the Greek rub, so. You guys can watch TV. They're being all quiet in there. There we go. All right. So I have the onions in, and the <coughs> I'm gonna put this over. Um, and the butter. Next, it calls for the garlic. So a teaspoon. A teaspoon. We're gonna use the cheat and see if I can taste the garlic this way. Oops. Yeah, that's enough. That's a lot of garlic, but it kind of fell out. Oh well. How's everyone's weekend going? <coughs> Make sure you say hi so you see you're here. <coughs> you're catching us on the replay, give me a hashtag replay. And I'm going to keep coughing. And The onions and the garlic and add spinach. How much spinach does it want? Mm -hmm. Baby spinach, where are you? Eight cups. That's a lot. That's a lot of spinach. It calls for how many ounces of spinach? Judy, where are you though? I'm actually getting my dirt. I just want to measure a cup away. Hard to measure spinach, so this should be interesting. Kevin's already home playing basketball. One. Oh, thought that was close. And it magically opened. Luckily, my glass didn't even fly. I think we're going to use this whole thing. We're going to use half of it, so I need to use this for another recipe too. So we're just going to put about half in. I'm going to knock that glass over and see it now. Alright, now what's next? So, for those of you just joining us, because I see some new ones, we are using our new season's best and slowly working our way through it and cooking the new recipes, which is fun. Well, so I have to wait until it's wilted, and then I can turn it on. Uh, 
that lip for me. So we're going to hit cancel. And now we are going to add, um, I'm going to add more seasoning, the chicken. Add the chicken. I've already seasoned one side of the chicken. So I'm going to put it in and then I'll season the other side. So I'm like flipping it over as I put it in. And then we'll put more jerky rub on it. It calls for um, chicken, boneless chicken breasts. Um, I'm using chicken tenders just because they're on sale. And you know me, I'm going to use what's ever on sale. We'll save it for another day. Let's season it up. See, I'm using our jerky rub. Well, are you guys cooking for dinner or are you ordering out? What are you doing today? Let's have some combo here, people. All right, so I'm putting in the stand on top of the chicken. And then I need rice. Where is my rice? I just reorganized this thing. Is it here? Yes. Nope, that's... Not rice. Where did I put my rice? Just got a whole bunch of, uh, there it is. We're going to put the rice in a ceramic bowl. I'm going to leave it in the stand. Okay, I'm going to put some on. And, okay, so we're gonna put the rice in the ceramic bowl. Okay. Oh, so the cucumbers and the tomatoes are not being cooked. Awesome. That helps. So I'll cut those up afterwards. So let's get this in. How much rice does this call for? See, the bad thing when I do new recipes is I don't know. Oh, I gotta put the broth in. I'm using actually veggie broth. It calls for chicken broth, but I already had the veggie open. So that's why we're using this. We're just gonna fill this up. We like rice. Oops. Last time I just filled up the water. So you're cooking the rice basically just like you would cook any other rice. Alright, there we go. And then this lovely top comes with it. Let me move this out of the way. I need a big, big kitchen. Let me just work on the space. I have plans though. I have plans that are going to unfold in a couple weeks. Home, home improvements are coming our way. I don't know if I can put this on in the case. I'm gonna try. Nope, you can't. Let's see. There you go. I'm gonna move over. I'm gonna spill. I know I'm gonna spill. Let's take this out. Alright. Now we're gonna put it in. And this is just gonna lower right on top of what I already have there. I'm gonna lock this on. Oops. Do it backwards. And then we're gonna change it to chicken and poultry and hit cook. And now I'm going to chop up the cucumbers. Ooh, crap. Chop up the cucumbers. These are seedless cucumbers. And I just bought that today and that one is already mushy. We don't need a ton. I literally just bought this from the store today. And it's kind of gross. But a little. Let me lock 
Let's see. They're okay. They didn't look like they were gross when I uh, came out when I get a bowl to put these in. I'm just going to have off the ends. And ta-da! So easy. These are actually like the perfect size for this tool. That's why I got them this size. Hello. What's everyone else cooking tonight? I always like to see when people tell me what they're cooking or what tools they've gotten online. So, I'm going to order from one of my shows because it's always fun. I love seeing it when everyone gets happy now. Everyone loves happy now. Alright, I am the new thing. Alright, we're just gonna dice up these tomatoes and I'm gonna put them in the bowl and then we're gonna wait and when it's done we're gonna garnish it with some fresh parsley and lemon zest. So super excited about this. And of course we need to put the seedless cucumbers and tomatoes on top. I'm just literally gonna cut these in half because they're cherry tomatoes. Which are on sale at Price Temper. Anyone's going to go do their grocery shopping? And I love how the pressure cooker is going to cook our chicken along with um, the rice. It makes it just so easy to cook a meal. I mean, this is even a meal I could cook during the week if I really wanted to. But I chose to cook it today because I was hoping to have some combos. This is um the utility knife. I know I have a couple of hostesses in there. I've shared a video of like how to choose the right knife for what you're doing. I have a tomato knife, but I already have the utility knife dirty. So I really didn't want to dirty a second knife. The tomato knife is just better because I wouldn't be getting this mush on my cutting board because it would cut right through it without pushing the juices out. Is why the a better knife. Tomato knives are better against for tomatoes. All right, well, that's it. So I'm just going to fight for this to finish, and then I'll put it in a bowl. Hello, everyone. And I will post a picture of what it looks like. Have a happy Saturday. Bye.